Hello everyone, this is going to be the high speed tour for the impatient of assembling in Kraken. I have rushes, import them, as always they are there. I then take the EDL, this is just track 1 to 4 EDL, set the project, set the rate of the EDL because the EDLs don't contain a frame rate. Um, then it's there, you have the EDL, have the rushes, right click here, find matches. And this source column has been filled with whatever it could find based on real data or clip name data and time code, whatever it could find from the rushes that were imported. Only what's imported will it match up to. So they're in. Pro Tools is ready here, waiting. Empty session, just a guide track and video. You need to have a scan, have a, have a scan match to them. There's the assembly. That's this. The session is called assembly. Assembly. Spot the Pro Tools with, without any selection. We'll just spot everything. So go through this information in more detail on the slower one. It's the full long tour, but mainly you need enough to clear tracks. Four tracks. Make sure you select the first one of four. And make sure it, the four tracks are empty because it'll they'll just get overwritten. And I will. Start. While it's spotting, you can actually slide around. Just don't click on the timeline because it will offset all further spotting. Sometimes this can slow down. I mean, if, 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 if you have a full session, this will slow down. So it's just always better just to do it in an empty session because then there's no risk of overwriting anything in the event of something not being correct. Some faulty EDL events that have bad data. Um, I haven't removed duplicates here, so you have a doubling. L and R are both there. Uh, there's a remove duplicates option in the menu, which would take away all blatant exact duplicates. In the future I will implement more clever healing and removal of anything which you wouldn't want, which would create a duplicate in the assembly. So that's done. And you can field recorder expand. The multi track is there. Basically assembled with some minor unimportant issues. You could work from here. It's all full links. It will all slave in Pro Tools. It will all slave back to the original files. That's so that's done. In the other video, I'm going to do this more precisely, talking about some other issues. Thanks. Bye.